Hey y'all, I'm coming at y'all today. It's your girl Keitha. I'm gonna do a tag video that I got from Miss P's channel. Hey girl, I just wanna say hello. Um, she actually did 15 weird facts about you. I love Miss P's channel. Um, she does a lot of great things on her channel. Um, college survival um, videos, she does reviews. She has a tech channel for all you Apple heads out there that love Apple products and you know other things of that sort. So go ahead and check out Miss P's channel and put her in the description right here. Right now, I'm going to get into 15 weird facts about your girl Keitha. So it's going to get a little real. Just, you know, hold on tight. Number one, what is a nickname that only your family calls you? Okay, I got two of them. Kiki, which is like to me, that is like the national. Anyways. Kiki, which is like the national black girl nickname of all times. So I inherited Kiki because my name is Lakeitha. Just it just freaking goes. And then I have Lock, which there's a short story behind that. My sister locked me in a closet one time. You know, she was being funny. She thought it was a joke, you know, but it was some real shit going on in my life. And I looked at Candyman probably when I wasn't supposed to, anyways. You know, it was very traumatizing, and that closet had a mirror in it. Um, she said Candyman three times, so so she calls me Lock. All right. Number two, what is a weird habit of yours? I do when I wake up first thing in the morning when I'm getting ready for work, I have to turn on music, and I have to randomly dance at any point or second throughout the day. That's just the way I live life I'm just about that life like that okay <laughs> but I will break out in a random dance it could be the bank head bounce the Harlem shake the Dougie it could be a two-step it could just be whatever I'm feeling and I really do dance when I'm eating which is weird and it's probably very stereotypical but especially when I'm eating chicken I just do the whole yes that's me that's me. I, I am that person. Okay, number three, do I have any weird phobias? Um, besides the usual one that most people have of heights, I'm going to have to go with ants. I cannot see ants in large groups. Chilling on the sidewalk, I'll start itching. Sidewalk in long lines, in groups, pout on something sweet. It just gives me the heebie-jeebies. I start freaking out. I start getting itchy just talking about them. I have just not been, you know, I step on ants because I do thug shit like that. Number four, what is a song that you love to blast and sing out long to yourself when you're alone? I am an old school head, so I listen to a lot of old music. I love Al Green, the Isley Brothers, Sam Cooke, Luther. I love them all. But you can catch me at your local stop sign. Red light, green light, yellow light. Blast the shit out of Ebony Eyes by Rick James and Smokey Robinson. That is my shit. I just be sitting. I go hard to that song. That's my song. Rick James, bitch. Five. What is one of my biggest pet peeves? My pet peeve, like, one of them is when I know somebody's, like, getting ran over or getting treated the wrong way and they don't speak up for themselves or they don't handle it for themselves. I'm always just trying to push them, you know. Don't bite your tongue. I don't like that. Like, say what you gotta say. There's a way of saying things, of course. But, you know, don't let nobody run over you. It's just not worth it. That that and crusty lips. There's too many daggone resources out there for, you know, lips. And I can't deal with people with crusty lips. I just won't accept it. What is one of your nervous habits? This is number six. One of my nervous habits is... I shake. I shake really bad. Number seven, what side of the bed do you sleep on? Now, you know, I just sleep wherever I can sleep because, you know, I got a full little queen size bed to myself. Wherever I lay my head is where I'm going to sleep. I think I pretend that like Makai Brooks, you know, Channing Tatum, Ely, J. Cole, 
it's that invisible man on the other side of the bed and I think that's why I keep it open like that for sure number eight what is your first childhood stuffed animal and what's his name okay I actually have one Miss P didn't have one I have one his name is Patrick Patches and I had him like ever since I was five I retired that hoe oh, I shouldn't call him a hoe I retired him when I was about 10 or 11 um I still kept around for decoration purposes, but I used to always sleep with Patrick Patches. He was my friend, he was my confidant, and you know, we was just ride or die for each other for real, for real. Number nine, what is a drink that you always order at Starbucks? I'm a one type of drink girl at Starbucks. I only know of one, I only order one, and that is the caramel frappuccino. I enjoy it, it's delicious. 10. What is a beauty rule that you always preach but never really practice? I'm going to go with Miss P on this. She said the same thing. Moisturize, moisturize, moisturize. Number 11. Which way do you face in the shower? Where's the damn water, nigga? Like, I'm just saying, like, you know, I guess there are certain situations. It seems like the most convenient and, you know, the most proactive way to clean your body. Number 12, do you have any weird body skills? Um, no, not really. Not that I'm going to tell you on YouTube. No, nah, but actually, I have tendonitis in this shoulder, and it pops. It pops. I don't even think, can you hear it? And not like that's a fucking talent or anything. It's fucking gross, but it, I can't do anything about it. Number 13, what is your favorite comfort food or a food that's bad for you but you love to eat it? I am very blessed to have high metabolism. So, nigga, I be eating whatever, you know, what's in arm's length. Um, at the time and period, I am a Grippo's fanatic because I'm at home. And for some reason, they do not sell these anywhere else but the, like, Midwestern states. So when I come home, I binge on Grippo's. I binge on green olives. I love green olives. I love sunflower seeds. Number 14, what is a phrase or exclamation that you always say? Um, I probably say actually um and uh a lot. But along with those, um, I think I call them fillers. It's curse words. I curse a lot. So it's a lot of what the fucks and shit and all that in my vocabulary when you work around marines all day you tell me what kind of freaking language you want to speak all right stop judging me 15 it's time to sleep what are you wearing ain't gonna happen all right so i've been commenting this video also if you want to go ahead and tag yourself go ahead and tag yourself to this video and do 15 random weird facts about yourselves also and then when you do make sure you post it as a video response because i want to watch all y'all's as well all right then bye